Mike for Wine Weirdos. Carlos here. Let's check out the 2014 Massacan Anaya. This wine's coming in at 12.2% and $30 a bottle. Yep, it's 837 cases made, and it's a blend of Tokai, Fruliano, Chardonnay, and Rivola Giallo, which I'm not even familiar with. I've never with heard some of those names. I'm kind of excited to try yeah, it. So interesting varietals coming out of Napa. On the nose, I'm getting some freshly grated ginger, which is nice. Maybe a little bit of tangelo, like unripe tangelo, and some lime elements as well. It's a little uh, muted at this point on the nose, a little low intensity, which I'm surprised at. What's it doing on the palate? On the palate, it's uh, kind of giving me the uh, the acid that I would expect from a fruit, but I'm not really mm -hmm. getting a whole lot of the fruit. I'm getting kind of mm. like the remnants of a fruit. It's mm. like a, it's like it's haunted with the fruit uh, acid, but you don't really yep. get much of the fruit. Mm -hmm. If there's anything, it might be like apricot or mm -hmm. something like that. A stone fruit that's kind of chilled to the point where you can, it's yep. faint. I think all the fruits are unripe at this point. I think that's what you're describing. For yeah. me, it reminds me of uh, different Italian white wines I've had. Even Chardonnay from Italy seems to have this sort of presence. It's in a drier style, uh, not quite oxidative, but almost similar to that element, which is exciting. I like this a lot. There's a little bit of herbaceousness on the back end. There is a little bit, yeah. I would, I can feel that. Um... It's like pesto or something. Yeah. It's funky. Interesting <laughs> stuff from Massacan. We'll be back with more here on Wine Weirdos. Cheers. Cheers.